hello and welcome to another bike and another restoration. This is a retro BMX. We have never done a BMX on this channel. I just thought it'd be really interesting and cool to get one of these in the garage. It's very close to my heart. These are the Panasonic Team Colours. This is a Rally Team Styler done in them exact colours and I couldn't resist. We actually kick-started the channel off with a Rally Team Corsa uh, which was done in these colours and he's still hanging just up there in the garage. So I thought it would be really cool to actually add this to the collection. Um, but yes, as I say, this is my first one. So yes, it's going to be interesting. Um, it's a Team Styler, I'm told. Um, the reason for that is it's got aero tubing whereas the Rally Burner had normal round tubing and this was apparently a bit lighter. It's also got the double bar on the handlebars there. Um, and yes, it's pretty much original. I'll go through the bike now. The bike itself, well, yeah, the tyres are perished, they need replacing. The brake calipers, well, they're original, but it should be completely black. Part of the metal has actually lost its blackness and gone this bronze colour. Same with the crank here, it's the original crank, but that definitely needs some attention. The, the grips, the sand grips, well, the other one is completely perished. We're going to have to replace that, and the brake levers aren't original, so we're going to have to find some brake levers as well. Um, but yes, the bike itself, the frame, well, the paintwork needs some attention and it definitely needs some new decals. But with all the bikes, what we generally do on this channel, we strip the bike down and we can take it from there. So what are we waiting for? Let's crack on and get this bike stripped down. Well, there's the BMX all stripped down. It wasn't any hassle at all, apart from one item, which was this seat post clamp here. Uh, the Allen key part had completely ground out, so I had some trouble getting the Allen key in there, so I had to tap it in to actually get some leverage. We're there now, the bike's all stripped down, and as we generally do, we've got a bucket down here with all the parts. As you take things off, put them all back on, ready for cleaning. We're gonna be getting on with that in a minute. We've also got to be ordering some replacement parts. But yes, just wanted to point out this little R down here on this rear stay, really nice touch. And I believe that this was an older frame. So yes, lots to be getting on with, lots of things to be buying. So what are we waiting for? Let's start be greasing some parts and start ordering online. Where are we up to? Well, these wheels have come out great. We've used some sodium hypochloride, which is used in the chemical industry to produce bleach. What I would say though, if you do manage to get hold of the stuff, is to wear a protective mask and also some gloves, because it's very powerful stuff indeed. I know that other people do use peroxide, which works just as well, but yes, very happy indeed with the result of these. I managed to get hold of some original Gunwall tires, so yes, can't wait to get these back on the bike itself. Regards to the frame and forks, etc. if you remember, the paint was scratched 
and also had a few chips. The decals were in a very sore state. So what I've decided to do, I've ordered some brand spanking new decals from SM Design, which I'll leave a link in the description below for you. So while they're actually on the way, I thought we'd get on with actually repainting the forks, the handlebars and also the frame itself. So give them a light sand and uh, for the actual keying of the paint. And I've also managed to match up the blue. So yes, I've got that all ready to go. I've also degreased all the parts. And if you remember, some of them were actually discolored. So we're actually gonna give them a light sand and spray them as well. So we've got plenty to be getting on with. Very excited indeed with the direction. I think it's going to be fantastic. So hang around because this is going to be a great build. Brilliant. Well, we have finally arrived. And if you're new to the channel, this is my favorite part of the restoration where all your hard work comes together. We've got all the group sets and all the parts on the side there, ready to go. We have bought a few items. One being, we've got some new handlebar grips. The old ones are completely perished at the end. So we've kept them original and we've got a better set available to us. We've also changed the brake levers. Uh, if you remember, they weren't original at all, so I've managed to find some Wyman original levers that was on the original spec of the bike, so very happy indeed about that. And we've got a new chain. Do keep hold of the old one though, because I've used that to actually measure up to get the exact same length, and the chain is all ready to go. The frame looks fantastic with them decals, and SM Design also provide the matching pads. So yes, I've got them here, and they should look fantastic. I've obtained an original seat as well from over the pond, so it's come a long way from America. So yes, this is here and should look fantastic. It is a little bit cold and I've not done a BMX, but I'm hoping with the gears it shouldn't take me too long. But what are we waiting for? Let's get this bike back together. Wow, well, what a result. Doesn't it look stunning? Really happy indeed with the results of this. All my hard work, it looks absolutely stunning and the pads really are the finishing touch. Loving the saddle, the grips, and yes, the wheels themselves, it looks amazing. Really happy indeed with the turnout of this bike. Forgot to mention, I did actually add some rear adjusters here to actually put the tension onto the chain itself. So yes, I can't wait to try this bike out, hang around for that. Um, yes, it wasn't too much hassle at all, it is very cold. Compared to a road bike, it really was a simple build to do. So, all that's left to do now is get this bike out and try it out. This 
been the Rally Aero Team Styler. What a beautiful retro BMX it is. I've really enjoyed restoring the bike and also having the fun riding it. There's never been a better time to recycle a bicycle, especially in these crazy times. If you do enjoy watching the videos, then please like and subscribe. Other than that, then visit our website at bikeitsuk.club. Thanks so much for watching and bye for now.